Welcome ladies and gentlemen, this is the fourth week of April. I want to say thank you for being here. This was a very short month. Anyway, this is the week of, uh, it's supposed to be the second week, the week of the 19th until um, uh, the 25th. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful life, shares and support. Let's get in this reading and see what is going to be transpiring for you um, uh, Aquarius, Gemini and Libran. All right, so um, this week of uh, the 19th until the 25th, in the center, I see a whole lot of money. Um, and um, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person, whoever this person is, a lot of you women, um, the center, you're going to be centered. All right, so you women... It doesn't really matter what age. I see some sort of a centering. Now, what we're recognizing here is that some sort of a celebration about a whole lot of money with a corporation institution and a whole lot of um, um, the energy of the moon, uh, a whole lot of secrecy. And I see that uh, some of you women could have to be paying back a corporation institution because I see information is coming out uh, and there is going to be some sort of a new storage uh, and what we see with this new storage in a corporation institution some sort of an emotional situation and problem that is happening so the center is around a woman now it's not showing up uh, who you guys are but it's definitely this week is centered around you um Aquarian, Gemini, and Libra people. And if you notice, uh, it is going to be affecting a lot of you women, okay? So whatever is happening and transpiring, be aware, ladies, that a whole lot of situation around you, a whole lot of things is going to be affecting a lot of you. Here we see that some of you women might have to pay back a whole lot of money. Some of you women could have had some sort of a secrecy around a lot of money. I see this is going to be coming out so the center of this uh, month uh, of this week uh, is going to be affecting a lot of you women. Let's look at the crowning of the week. The crowning of the week, a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man. Whoever this man is and whatever this man have done, people, a corporation, institution is now recognizing a situation with this man. Now, this could be a businessman, your father, or uh, someone... This uh, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person, this um, either a businessman, it could have been your husband, your partner, um, they are now recognizing a, a foul play that some of you ladies had help this Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man. Is it your father? Is this a, a boss, a supervisor? Is this someone in a business, a corporation that a lot of you have been dealing with? Uh, Obviously, it's a situation of the work because as you recognize, uh, um, the pair, the, the crowning, it has to do with a, a man, some sort of a data information about a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person, um, it comes out where a lot of you are going to be celebrating over this man and they recognize this man have took a whole lot of money in a corporation institution. It could have been his business. So, um, and this man has been cheating other clients. And I see some sort of an investigation. Something comes up because here is showing up a whole lot of money. And a corporation institution is now recognizing um, some sort of a play or some sort of a way how this man was getting money from people in a corporation institution. And I see the truth is now coming out. So your week is grounded by the nine of pentacles in reverse and some sort of a, a money something information over some money is going to be coming out and you're going to be recognizing what a taurus Virgo, a capricorn man have done um and this could be a situation that this man is your husband or your husband lawyer that has been hiding a whole lot of money and it's going to be coming out so a lot of you women have a enemy okay you have an enemy at the workplace. So you ladies, uh, um, you do have an enemy at the workplace. So be aware of this. Uh, so a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming a corporation institution that tried to hide a whole lot of money. 
and lied about a whole lot of money. And I see um, this, this uh, situation is going to be coming out where information is going to be showing up a whole lot of money um, that's a corporation or someone in a corporation has been holding or someone has been taking a lot of money from a corporation institution. And I see that this situation is going to be giving a lot of you ladies a, a, a new story, pushing you forward and some sort of an emotional situation that a lot of you um, have been dealing is now going to be over because they recognize that a corporation have been lying and has been holding on, on a lot of money. Then we recognize that truth is going to be coming out about a whole lot of money. A lot of you are going to be celebrating overcoming a, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man. A lot of data information shows up that this man has been holding back on money that a lot of you were not aware of and information is going to be coming out. A whole lot of data and information, invoices that this person has never paid or this person did not um, pay the correct taxes, that sort of a thing could be coming up and people are going to be recognizing what this man has done. A corporation institution is going to be recognizing that a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person along with a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person tried to pull off uh, um, some sort of a problem. And uh, information, emotion, there is going to be some sort of an emotional situation because you Aquarians, Gemini and Librans are going to be recognizing that a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person along with a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person um, they have picked up, a corporation have picked up what these people have done. No new start is coming up for these two people, whether or not they were your sisters or brother or your friends. Uh, no new start is coming up for them. But for you, um, Aquarian, Gemini, and Libra people, you're going to be receiving a new start. I see um, a lot of you are not have, offering any love or affection to a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person and an Aries and a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion person because they recognize uh, the foul play and that these two have to collaborate with an old Pisces Cancer or Scorpion man to create a whole lot of problems and a whole lot of issues. Uh, and uh, this is what is happening and transpired. Okay. Now, a whole lot of data information about a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man is now out. Uh, and a lot of you. However, this is coming up and it's transpiring. I see that this man is going to be a, 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 a love to pay you. Um, I see a whole lot of secrecy around this man. Whoever this man is, there is uh, so much secrecy around this man. And I see um, this could be um, a father or some sort of a family member or it could be your boss. And I see a whole lot of emotional situation that is going to be happening and it's going to be transpiring. A lot of you are dealing with siblings and friends. Um, a lot of you could be dealing with your your boss or your supervisor that is a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person. A lot of people are going to be recognizing the secrecy um, that um, uh, two older men were keeping, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man and a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person. And they're going to be recognizing some sort of a connection um, between these people so you're recognizing or you're seeing exactly what is happening and transpiring because you're recognizing that people have secrecy and these secrecy are now going to be coming out and people are going to be recognizing um, um, how people were playing each other actually because if you notice uh, um, they're going to be recognizing a problem between an old man and a young person and how um, this old man and this young person it could be um, if your father is a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person that you recognize that your father um, choose um, the young person that is a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person but there, there are some sort of issues and situation with your sisters or brother or with your friends especially people between the age of 19 and 49, that they're in some sort of a serious situation and a corporation institution is really not going to give these people a new start because of what these people have done. So if we look at the situation, whoever is an Aries or a Sagittarian person is not going to give, receive a new story. I see their boss or managers or a corporation recognize that this person had gone too far. These two people had just gone too far and they are not recognizing. 
So I see a whole lot of worries uh, and a cycle, a situation, a whole lot of worries. The situation is not yet over. There is a whole lot of worries about money and a situation is not yet over. But I see there could be people who are going to be success, uh, success successfully overcoming some of you ladies. Okay. Or, um, because if you notice you have gone through, um, a whole lot of problems. So, where we saw a whole lot of communication and a whole lot of problems and we recognize exactly what was transpiring. I see a corporation institution, um, was going to be given a Pisces cancer or scorpion and then they recognize some sort of a connection with the Pisces cancer or scorpion person and an older man. And they're like, no, no, no. Um, we have to look at this thing before we make any, any decision um what to do all right so as we look uh, we see the energy of the seven of ones a lot of you need to stand your grounds and face up to whatever is going on okay and i see they're going to be recognizing i see a whole lot of you are worried about a whole lot of money but why is this worried and it's as if a whole lot of you won't stand up in order to receive this money then uh, we see the energy of uh, um the nine, um, the eight of uh, ones, and the eight of ones is about uh, a whole lot of information. It's going to be coming out about a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man, whoever this man is. It could have been your boss or your father, but whatever the information that is coming out about this person, you're going to be seriously, seriously surprised of uh, who this person is and what is happening and transpiring. I see a whole lot of you are going to be overcoming um, this Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man. Whoever this man is, they're going to be recognizing some sort of a foul play. And I see this man is now um, very, very worried because they recognize and they have found a lot of data and information um, that this man was hiding um, a lot of business, some sort of a business or investment or hiding some sort of a information from you, Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person. A lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming your enemy because you notice at the bottom you had an enemy in a corporation. A lot of you, Aquarian, Gemini's or Libran, um, you have an, a, um, an enemy in a corporation institution that is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person that was trying to get away with a whole lot of money, but they didn't um, because um, you stood up, you found out something and make a... Um, a quick decision that bring your enemy down and they're now recognizing um, this. So then when we look at this corporation institution and this enemy, um, I don't see a new start is going to be coming up for this young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person because the corporation institution recognized that whoever this person is has uh, created some sort of a problem. So no love. A lot of you are not lo um, looking at love in this week. It's as if a lot of you is not open for love, but a lot of you are working on some sort of issues with your kids. For whoever have kids, I see you are working on issues in order to balance out some sort of a problem, issue, situation with a kid. I see that a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person is going to be communicating with you, whatever um, that was happening and transpiring. I see um, the communication is coming to you from this person. And I see um, that whatever this information is that is coming to you from this person, I see that um, a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person, whoever this person is and whatever, it's as if this person wants a new start with a lot of you women. So women 50 years and older, um, I see um, a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person is going to be, you know, asking you for some sort of a new start. But I see you are not interested in um, this. I think you have uh, closed off the door um, to even the thought of... Uh, uh, recapped in any moment with this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person, okay? It is as if, uh, you know, we have uh, clear our karmas and uh, it is good to be friends, but I no longer want to um, get in um, a space where 
um, we have to contend with each other. It's as if uh, um, a way of divorce pieces it. Um, you know, if I can do anything, uh, we can have a cup of coffee, but that's about it. I don't need to be having dinner with you, okay? So I think, um, you know, a lot of you and a lot of you are going to be dealing because the energy of number 88, okay? Number 88, and you see the 10 of pentacles, the 9 of pentacles, number 88 is the shift of energy. And it's as if some of you could be receiving and a lot of you, a whole lot of money could be coming back to you. So this, this um, especially the first two, three, four days, uh, um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday is going to be, um, you know, good because it has to do with money. And what is so positive is that uh, you were dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person or whoever this person is. Uh, I've created a whole lot of problems um, for you guys. And um, whatever the problems is that this person has created, a lot of you are going to be now recognized in a hey. Um, this person has been working against me. It is as if it is something that you were not seeing, but it's coming up. It's as if, you know, some of you is a family member. Some of you, um, it is someone close to the family. Some of you is your ex-partner. Some of you is, uh, um, your husband or your partner. You know, it is a kind of a weird shift thing. But for some of you, it's an uncle, a far uncle, uh, or a uncle, um, your mother's brother. You know, that's sort of a situation. So all of these men, if you recognize these men, 50 years and older, are all in the reverse because um, as, uh, information is coming out. And especially the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person at the end of, uh, it is as if it's the weekend. Because in the, the weekend, a lot of you are going to be turning your back to um, a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. You're just going to decide you know, whether or not is your sister or brother, it's not working out. Let, 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 let's let go and don't, you know, um, we, we both have to understand that, you know, whether this is a sister or a brother or a friend, it's as if, yeah, yeah, um, I'm not going to be wasting my love on this anymore. Okay. Um, also a lot of you, um, a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion person between the ages of, um, 19 and 25 is going to be wanting some sort of a contact. Um, and they're going to be going via a corporation institution in order to connect to you. Some of you, this could be a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion person, a corporation institution. And you ladies, you older ladies are going to be firing this person or, um, making sure that this person never get another, um, uh, a job because of something that they have done and this has uh, uh, created a bad name for a corporation institution or a bank or a financial institution but it's like um, you are a personal officer and you're making sure because you have seen the play of these two young lady and you're making sure that these two young lady never get the chance to create this problem and this issue ever again and I see a lot of you, some sort of information, if your child's father is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person, some sort of information is coming to you or coming to you from your child's father, some sort of information and situation that was transpiring. All right, so let's look at this cross. This cross is all about money and a lot of you uh, women, Aquarian, Gemini, and Libra women are going to be standing on top of your enemies, okay? You're both going to be supporting each other and standing on top of your enemies, uh, whoever and wherever your enemies are. I see a whole lot of worries, and the worries is not yet over, but a lot of you are going to be overcoming some sort of an issue at the workplace. Uh, and uh, whatever this issue is, is that a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion person has created this issue, and you're going to be standing your ground, so against this person in order to facilitate some sort of a um, situation where you recognize some sort of a shift of uh, uh, instability that a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person have created. So let's break down this week. So we see um, Monday, Tuesday, it is about um, communication, data, documentation, and um, as, uh, worries, okay, worries. So it's as if some of you need to stand your ground against uh, 
some sort of information and data and make sure that people pay you um, because they have spilled some sort of a data and information. And, you know, it's like hold this company liable to your data and information being um, uh, exposed. OK, hold this company liable um, because of your date, because they have something to do with your data and information is being exposed. OK. Um, then I see on Tuesday, a whole lot of money. I see they're going to be recognizing something about a Virgo man. And I see a Virgo man is now worried. And I see a lot of you are going to be successful over this Virgo man and overcome what this Virgo man has created for a lot of you. So I see a situation is not yet over for a Virgo man, but yet still, um, uh, for you and a Virgo person, but maybe this is a supervisor or someone um, you were working for. I see a whole lot of worries uh, um, for this Virgo man because they have uh, recognized that this Virgo man has, and, and, and has spit door information and data and recognize something about this Virgo man and a cycle is not yet over and a Virgo man have to pay a lot of money, okay, because of some sort of a data um, that this day, and this, this, uh, um, Virgo man have a uh, data. They, this Virgo man has access some sort of a data and they're recognizing this. So, all right, let's move forward. Wednesday, Wednesday, what a day. Information is coming out, but this is going to be good. Whatever the information that is coming out is about some sort of a documentation information. Um, about a, 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 a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man and I see emotions for this person and I see um, this person is caught up in a lot of emotional imbalance in their world and it could be your father or it could be a father figure or it could be your partner and I see that you ladies are going to be um, receiving this information and data but whatever it is about this man um, is going to be good because you're going to be successfully overcoming what this man has done to you. So um, some of you ladies might have to be paying this uh, man back and query. So you Aquarian, Gemini or Libra woman, um, you might have to be paying a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man might because of something. So not all of you, some of you, okay? Um, it can be a divorce where you have to pay alimentation to this man and you are not very happy and some sort of information is going to come out in order to release you from this, okay? Uh, let's look at the center of the week. And here we see this money and it's some information, the money, it could have been this man you're divorcing a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man or um, is your ex-boss that didn't want to pay you any money and a corporation is going to be recognizing that this man has a lot of money that he never shows up on the books. Bam. So there you're going to be getting out of this situation. So thank God for that, uh, um, for you ladies. Then we're moving forward and we're looking at uh, Friday going in the weekend. A lot of you are going to be having some sort of a new start. A lot of you women are going to be having some sort of a new start, but a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion man is not. Um, and a lot of you, some sort of a emotional problems you were dealing with in a corporation institution um, is going to be over because your enemies are going to be leaving. So your enemies, people that was working against you and was creating a whole lot of problems, your enemies are now going to be leaving because they have recognized that your enemies are trying to work against you and they recognize who these people are and I see they're going to be leaving. Okay, so um, that is good. So when we look at the situation Friday going into the weekend is that a lot of you um, that works with a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person or a young Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person, they're going to be recognizing what these two people have done and created some sort of a problem for some of you um at work in the work environment and uh, uh you are going to be getting this new start but they are not going to be getting this and i see um you know a lot of it is coming at you but you know what it, it is what it is you win some you lose some and they have lost and you 
are going to be overcoming this situation and it's going to be moving on in a very, very positive direction. So, you know, hate, you know, people will always hate you, especially when you are successful and when you successfully, um, you know, walk away from who they are and just recognize that, hey, um, you know, how you are vibrating is not what I'm looking for in my life. So I see a lot of people are do not like that, to be honest, you know. And this is why I say to a lot of people, your big, your friends is your biggest enemies. You know, your friends are your biggest enemies. And a lot of people do not understand, but your friends are the one who are jealous of you when they don't get to share you know, the same thing that you have, you know, people, um, friends, people, friends, people for, um, certain reasons. Okay. And in this case is that some of you, your friends had friend you because they thought they could have profit from you. And that is the reason why. So a whole lot of information and data is going to be coming out about a, uh, a, a businessman. Okay, and there you're going to be seeing a connection because this is a situation that is taking place. Um, this uh, uh, for some of you is at a workplace, a work environment, and for some of you, um, is your personal life. Um, and it, it, it is if you recognize where the major problems is coming up, it's Friday. All right, but it is positive because here we see you moving um, forward and a lot of you who are waiting for a lot of money, this money is going to be coming in. But I see whoever is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, I see you're going to be turning your back to this person because you recognize that this person was basically profiting from you and you're going to be recognizing that. A corporation institution is not going to give a um, Pisces Cancer Scorpion person and you start because they recognize what this person have done. I see people in the weekend is going to be making a decision about this person. Then we recognize um, that there is emotional imbalance in the weekend. And this emotional imbalance in the weekend is a whole lot of communication between a lot of you and a Scorpion. So if a lot of you are in a relationship with a Scorpion, I think the Scorpion might say, hey, you know, I want to uh, revamp this relationship or the situation. And you're going to be thinking, um, no, not really. You know, let it be. We have gone through this. Let's just move on and accept uh, our life as it is. And I see that's the sort of a situation that is going to be coming up and transpiring. And a lot of you are just going to be recognizing, hey, let me let this go. And let me just uh, um, understand that, you know, whatever the love is, whatever the situation is, whether it was your child's father or whatever that was transpiring, you know, you are over this. Let it go. Because it's as if you're over this, you're letting it go and you want this person to understand and move on. I do love you, Aquarian, Geminis and Libran. Um, please recognize um, that you are about to make a whole lot of changes in your life. And uh, um, accept that. I got a girl. Please show your love by thumbs up, share, share, share. These videos is going to be powerful. You guys have all the money in this week. Namaste.